boat. That's right. No more. We're not asking. We're demanding. Give us the vote. Selma, produced by Brad Pitt and Oprah Winfrey, brings the fight for voting rights to the big screen. Through the 1965 historic march and brutal police standoff on the Edmund Pettus Bridge in Selma, Alabama. Bloody Sunday, as it's called, helped prompt voting rights legislation. A Hoosier and his wife worked on the film. It's eerily prophetic how, um, how this movie that is about what happened 50 years ago is almost about what's happening right now. Justin so, um, Jordan, who grew up in Fort Wayne, landed a production assistant job on the film, authenticating the set of the historic march. The DePaul grad had worked for an Atlanta advertising company for 10 years until a round of layoffs. <laughs> and my wife said, babe, why don't you just pursue your dream? Just go after what you love. He did. Volunteer work led him to his lucky break when a film production designer told him about a film coming to town and offered him a shot. The opportunity to work for them was absolutely a dream come true. Jordan then encouraged his wife Charity, an inspiring actress, to audition. She won the role as Viola Jackson, the mother of an Alabama man who died trying to gain the right to vote. Jimmy Lee Jackson's death brought Martin Luther King Jr. to lead the march from Selma to Montgomery. Charity's role brought her side by side with Oprah. You have Bradford Young, an amazing cinematographer. You have Ava DuVernay. She's the first uh, female director to win Sundance. So I was already ecstatic. And then we add Oprah to the mix and it's over the top. Aside from landing their first major film, the couple says the storyline has forever changed them. To be more responsible for my right to vote, which so many people have died and sacrificed for. Yeah, we like to be entertained, but we also like to learn. And this film gives you a little bit of both. I hope that at the end of it, that everyone comes out of the theater and motivated and inspired to make America a better place for all people. While Selma may not have won all of the Golden Globe Awards the cast had hoped for, the Jordans are hoping communities across the country will still win by uniting for change. In downtown, Sandra Chapman, Channel 13, Eyewitness News.